I'm Mark Medina here with USA Today Sports, and I'm here in Orlando on site of the NBA's campus bubble at the ESPN Wild World of Sports Complex. Right behind me is the Coronado Springs. This is where they're hosting a lot of media members, including myself, that have access to the bubble. As we go our way up the campus, uh, you can either take the elevator or take the stairs. We're gonna take the stairs. Uh, we have been encouraged to you know, use the bird cage and push our own luggage just to maintain safe social distance with the hotel employees. I got my N95 mask here. And right here, the NBA gave us these Disney Magic Bands. It looks like a watch. It's basically a hotel room key that also does a bunch of different things that helps monitor your temperature. But for now, uh, you see these Mickey Mouse ears, right? You just match that up with what's going on here and with the door. And voila. And so here's the hotel room. This is where we're gonna be for a good amount of time as the season gets underway. They have some pretty nice views. You can see that over here, you've got a good view of the courtyard area down below. And on the other side of the hotel, uh, an outdoor pool. I'm not gonna be doing that anytime soon. I have to get tested at some point today for COVID-19. And then after that test, I have to stay in my room under quarantine for a week. I can't leave. But exceptional when my meals are delivered three times a day outside my door. Now, heaven forbid I am tested positive, the NBA will quarantine me for an additional 14 days on an off-campus property. Well, let's hope I don't have to deal with that problem.